Well, that's not terrifyingly creepy whatsoever. Huh. All right, I might want to go ahead and make sure we slow down for just a minute so that I can see what's going on with this other raft and maybe build a couple extra steps behind me so that I don't step into the waiting jaws of Kilometer. But friends, it looks like we have found another abandoned raft floating out here at sea, potentially full of all sorts of goodies that we might be able to collect. But let's see what we can grab from this before it goes under. And hopefully it does not cause our ship to go under. Can I reach? All right, let's do this quickly. Oh, we made it! We made it! Oh, I picked up the crate! Oh, and there, the raft is going down. I didn't even have time to see what was inside of the crate. Oh, I wish I could collect some of the things. We got a recipe for vegetable soup. Oh my gosh. All right, I think I might have to actually go ahead. Get away, you brats. Ugh. I think I might actually have to go ahead and uh, we might have to make a, a soup pot so that we can see what we could actually craft in a soup pot because apparently I could make a fruit compote now, which is pretty exciting. And I do want to work on expanding our raft and maybe even figuring out how, let's put the sail back down now, how we might be able to protect ourselves from the biting jaws of Kilometer destroying what we have built because I'm getting kind of tired of that particular shark. I really loved having our good friend Miles around like, oh yes, okay, we can harvest these without the bratty seagulls trying to go ahead and collect them again. We've got so many beets. Oh, I feel like we need to do a little dance, like a little dance to the beets. Ince, ince, ince. So many beets. Ince, ince, ince. All right, let's go ahead and make sure we get this going. Getting pretty hungry. Oh, kilometer! No, not the other! That's it. I've had enough. Kilometer just destroyed my second collection piece. I am so irritated at him right now. I'm gonna put a raw beet down here for just a minute. Uh, and then what's going on? Okay, my water is good to go. There we go. All right, let's 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 go ahead and water these guys. There, ah, I'm so irritated with Kilometer. Today's mission, my friends, is going to be getting a sharper pointy stick so that we can attack a uh, Kilometer because he's not the cool shark that our wonderful, wonderful, may he rest in peace, and in my stomach, Miles was. He's just not nearly as cool as Miles. He's really a bit of a brat. He kind of gets into everything. He tries to eat me on the regular. He's destroyed a lot of our, our little raft. Not cool, not cool, buddy. So instead, uh, I wanna go ahead and we're gonna try to figure out how to make, now that we have collected from that very creepy abandoned floating raft, how to make a metal spear. And to make a metal spear, we actually need to have metal ingots. And I'm pretty sure to get metal ingots, we're going to need to go ahead and craft ourselves up, where is it, a smelter. And to craft a smelter, we're going to need to get a dry brick to sacrifice in the name of science. And check that out, our brick is actually dry. All right, come here, you. Research, oh, it's gone. Yes, but we can now learn how to make the smelter. Sweet. So to make this smelter, we need a lot more dry bricks. <laughs> but we have a ton of nails and scrap, so now I just need to make more dry bricks. Great, that's fine. I'm sure it'll be super easy. Oh, there's my cooked beet. I'm sure it's gonna just be so easy to stumble upon more dried bricks hanging around. All right, let's get that cup over here. Gotta get some water. And there's another raft, actually. All right, let's turn ourselves towards it. Just in case that helps out a little bit. No, no, no. We need to turn this way. There we go. Man, I'm really thirsty. Maybe I should be focusing on... getting my hunger and my thirst all the way up before we get to this point. Plenty of planks. A cup of fresh water. Nice. All right, let's go ahead and... There. 
All right, can I pull us towards that other raft to see what we've got? All right, so it seems that even though I really want to tell Kilometer, like, what the freaking for... Get away, you rats! It's going to be a little harder than I thought to actually attack Kilometer with a metal. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think we can make our way over to that raft. We're going in the wrong direction. Unless I can, like, go directly this way. Don't think we can. We're passing it by. We'll just go ahead and let it go for now. Alright. Let me try to collect my thoughts for a little bit. Goodbye, Raft. Let's try to collect our thoughts and figure out what our next plan of action should definitely be. I'm gonna cook up some beets. I think let's work on my health real quick because we've been having some issues with health. And I would like to expand our raft just a teensy bit. I need more collection things. Oh, there we go. Oh, an island! An island! Yes! Go this way! Another island! That's what I want! Pull us towards that island, please. We'll collect up these planks. Oh, look at the sunrise! And in just a second, I'll try to make another collection piece. Because definitely need another collection piece. Also, is this beet almost ready to eat? Probably not. I should probably go ahead and try to eat some of these coconuts. Can I just eat the coconut? I can. All right, I'm eating all these coconuts. There we go. That was really delicious. All right, now I have a cooked beet. I'm gonna go ahead and eat that too. These beets are, are growing quite well. Let's see if we can rotate ourselves over to this island. And let's see if we can go ahead and get over here. Oh my gosh. Everybody, stop it. Oh, dang it, kilometer. This is why I want to be able to stab you better, kilometer. Yes, that's going to be our new goal, is getting the metal so that we'll be able to really stab at Kilometer. And thankfully, it looks like we might have something that we can collect over here. I don't know if it'll be metal fragments. Oh, I need to work on making some shark bait. Because if we had shark bait, then Kilometer wouldn't be able to mess with us for a little while. Yes, come this way. Am I even going to need to anchor if I manage to get myself right into this little nook? Let's find out. Okay, lift you. Come on, up. Up with the sails, please. Yes, I am going to need to anchor. Yep. Yes! All right, another island! This is fantastic. Another great island. It's got a little beach. Look at this gorgeous, gorgeous tree. It's gonna have planks. Hopefully it'll even have some delicious coconuts for me. No coconuts? Okay, no coconuts, but I will take those planks. And what else do we have? <gasps> Another pineapple, yes! Oh, wonderful. No seeds from that pineapple, but what about this one? We have found a bounty of pineapple. Yes, and that one had seeds. All right, uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Phew, okay. That was a little nerve-wracking because I don't know where Kilometer might be and if he might be in a bit of a mood to nibble on me. There are some watermelons, don't mind if I do. Some big flowers. Not terribly much and there's nothing, unfortunately, to harvest in the water. Man, that first island we found really was a paradise island for us. Thanks. Palm tree seeds. You know what? I want to plant a palm tree seed as like a victory thing. And let me go ahead and eat these pineapple real quick. There we go. I want to have a palm tree and we're going to name our palm tree. It's going to be our friend. It's going to be amazing. Here is what I have been waiting for though. Also, we can throw out this like breaking apart piece. Okay, come on. Palm leaf. Plank. Mangoes. 
Yes, I got a mango! That's what I was really hoping for. Fantastic. Very happy to have a mango. Uh, all right, so we've got a mango now. Unfortunately, we don't have any mango seeds. I'm gonna search the area just to make sure we didn't like drop one in the grasses. Yellow flower, flowers. Yeah, that's great and all. And normally I collect tons of flowers. In the future, we'll have tons of decorative flowers, but not right now. All right, jump. Can I get anything from this bamboo at all? No, nothing for, oh wait. What's this? Wait, what? Oh, how did that reach through the plant and destroy my raft? Well, that sucks. All right, well, let's take just a minute to rest. Do I have anything else I could cook? I guess we could do some fishing, but as you can see, there's nothing to really collect from this island other than what we have already got. I am definitely happy about having some more watermelon though. <gasps> the brats, they have taken everything. Oh, all right. Those seagulls definitely were being a bit rude to me and took some of our stuff, but we'll be okay. Let's repair that. Let's expand this. I need to work on some collection nets. Need to get a little bit of water. Let's take just a moment to catch our breath and figure out what the next steps are. There we go. I've got lots of planks now, which is great. And we have retriever and a receiver and antenna blueprints. I have a whole bunch of scraps, watermelon, pineapple seeds. Here's some more watermelon seeds. Here's some pineapple seeds. Very important, we'll get those guys going in the future. I have another recipe. I really don't feel like we need these flower seeds, but we'll wait and see. We'll wait and see, you might say. I do want to get some palm trees planted, but I think they need like ultra giant huge plot. Kilometer! Come on. All right, there you go, buddy. That's what we're going to, to do a little bit of research for. What do I need to make more dried bricks? Because that would be extremely helpful. So wet bricks need sand and clay? <sighs> All right, friends, you know what that means. We're just gonna need to head out. We're just gonna need to keep going out on the open ocean. Let's put this right here. We're just gonna need to keep headed out then. And we'll have to remove this. And we might have to be more careful on future island discoveries to make sure that we are actually towards an island that will help us with gathering tons of things out of the water. And if we wanna gather a lot of things out of the water, we might want some shark bait. If we had shark bait, we could distract the shark for quite a bit and he would focus on other things and not on eating us, which would be really nice. All right, let's go ahead and put that there. Let's go ahead and plant more beets. No, no, don't eat the raw beet for crying out loud. We'll plant more beets. I have a nice watermelon that we could eat. I think I should probably get a fish. Maybe do a little bit of fishing. Um, especially so that we can have... Let's look at this. Because shark bait, if we had some shark bait, then we can keep the shark busy. We can distract him and he will leave us alone long enough that we could possibly look for metal. And the sooner we can get more sand, the sooner we'll be able to make a smelter. The sooner we make a smelter, the sooner we can start turning these metal and maybe even the scrap. Can I do anything cool with the scrap? I've already researched scrap. I've already researched nails. Oh, I haven't researched stones. So we'll research stones. Now I can make a paint mill if I wanted to turn flowers into color. I can make a bucket if I wanted. Interesting. If I research bolts, I could make a scrap hook. It's faster, which would actually let me get a whole bunch of the resources from the next water area we find faster. Nice. And if I research a hinge, we can learn how to grow large trees. I could have my palm tree friend. Yes, that would be so cool. Explosive powder. Where am I going to get explosive powder? Pardon you. Metal fishing rod. 
All right. But what I really need right now is another passive way to collect things. Because right now all this stuff is going by while I'm trying to study. And I just want to do a little R&R &R sometimes. You know what I mean? Also need to repair this. All right, there we go. Okay, so collection net. Need a bit more rope for collection net. Can't believe he destroyed it. Again, Kilometer, you are quite the jerk. Just saying. Miles had a lot better, he was a lot more behaved. Wait, you're also a jerk. I wonder if I might be able, as terrible as it sounds, I wonder if I might be able to actually um, poke the seagull with my stick and maybe have some seagull to eat, <laughs> which sounds awful, but look, we're trying to do our best to survive here. All right, I think I probably could. All right, I wanna expand the raft a little bit more and then put the collector out on that. Got this. There we go. Don't mind if I do. Dang it. Couldn't collect that. And we'll put this out there. What's this? Oh, it's a plank. It looked like something else for some reason. And you know what? That's gonna be the, the steps for right now. We'll do some fishing. We'll make some shark bait and put it to the side. We'll expand the raft a little bit. Keep an eye. Oh, I need to make some fresh water. Haha, -ha, fresh water. Water the crops. And I think we'll work on getting more collectors down because the more collectors we have, the easier life is going to be for us because we won't have to focus on manually collecting everything. And we can start focusing more on research and development. So that's the new plan. <laughs> At least we ran into another island. But all right, guys, I'm gonna work on expanding this a little bit, maybe trying to get ourselves some more plastic because I am almost out of my plastic hook. And no, no, do not get to eat that, you brat. <laughs> and I'm gonna repair this because apparently the collectors are just like shark chew toys. I am not making shark chew toys for you, you brat <laughs> of a shark. <laughs> and then we'll slowly and, ex and surely expand our home next time. So if you guys could, do please leave a like. There we go, get away! I'm gonna poke you with the stick too! <laughs> leave a like for our little rat, or our little beats, dance into the beat there. Well, um, you know, we stare out at the open abyss and hopefully run into many more fun adventures. Another island, but I, am I out of, oh dear. I might need to make another, another anchor. And hopefully we'll run into many more adventures next time. So I'll see you guys then. And remember, stay curious.